jump dump back and today we're going to talk about chamfering the valve openings now i'm going to be doing this on a set of oldsmobile heads but you can definitely use this technique on other engines as well i'm going to play around with the new way cutters and see about adding this chamfer to the top which is going to take that 90 degree cut at the top of a stock head and i'm just going to put a light chamfer on it so that it smooths that air transition so before inserting pilots you always want to clean those guides Again, I'm using a gun cleaning kit, um, but you know you can get a brush or anything else in there. Then you're going to go ahead and install that pilot. I'll cover blade adjustments later in the video, but these are adjusted right now to the openings for the intake valves. Now it's imperative when you're starting this cut because you're not going to be on a flat surface to begin with that you start with no pressure and that you very lightly just turn it around. It is likely going to get hung up and just don't turn it backwards and like I said no pressure and keep turning. And as you can see, you got a little hung up here. All I do is gently try to remove more pressure and just slide it over that hang up and eventually it'll start cutting again. As your surface becomes more even, the cutting will go a lot smoother. And I just keep cutting until I get a nice even chamfer around the entire diameter. And here you can see that the entire diameter has been chamfered. Now you can see that this head won't fit in there until I adjust the blades. So what I'm going to do is loosen this holding screws and then I'm going to slide those blades in and then try to evenly adjust them. Now I'm checking the fitment and make any last adjustments and then tighten the blades in place. Now I'm ready to begin cutting those exhaust openings. And as I make checks along the way, you can see here the circumference is not entirely yet cut. And now you can see here that the entire ring has been chamfered.
And that sums up how to chamfer those valve openings on Oldsmobile engines, and you can apply this to others as well. I am junked up, and thank you for watching. Remember, I try to get back to each and every one of your comments, so don't be afraid to leave one.